Hello everyone, today we will see in this video how to create a bullseye in canvas. So this will we will be creating that you are seeing right now. So let's get started. First of all, I'll draw canvas with an ID of bullseye, then width 500 and height also 500. Then I'm starting writing my script. That will be where canvas equals to document dot get element by ID and that ID will be bullseye. Then I'll writing I'll get the context that will be 2D for the canvas. Now I'll start writing for that I'll be starting my begin path. Then I'll write arc because we will be you know creating circle. So for that we will be needing arc. So I'll be passing arguments in the arc that will be x and y 250, 250 then and radius of 70. I'll start with angle 0 and then I'll finish at 2 pi. Okay, now let me after that first in bullseye it will be you know a fill circle of yellow color so I'll be filling it with the color yellow and I'll be calling fill function then I'm drawing on canvas and I'm closing the path now let's see how it will look in chrome so refresh and there you can see a yellow circle now after that what I'm doing I'm again starting the begin path for my next circle and in that i'll just change my radius to let's say 90 and change its basically what i need i'm doing is i'm just giving stroke style here that will be red a second circle is always red and giving it a line width line width of let's say 25 and let's see how it will look in chrome so there is some space in between so to cover that space we need we will need to change it to 80 let's say now let me create the third circle that is blue one next i'm going to create radius for one oh, let's say 100 then i'm changing its color to blue and i'm keeping the same line width now next refresh so there you can see now it's having no space in red and blue and also it blue circle is there now next again i'm creating fourth with radius 120 and color black after that also i'm creating fifth one that will be having 150 radius let's say no 160 and then color is also going to be black and line width let's say 2 refresh and there you can see your bullseye now what i'm doing you have seen that there is so much line of code repeating so for that now what i'm going to create is array for radius also i'm creating one array that will be having value 80 100 120 and 160 also for red that is means like color also i'm creating an array red blue black and last one is black also for line width i'm creating an array that will be having value 25 25 25 and 2 as you can see now i'm removing all these and what i'm doing is i am looping this like in a for loop so for variable i am defining for loop now i'll be you know increasing it with one until four i'm passing the array that is radius in the place of radius with i and stroke style that will be color i line width is having array line width i so 
our code is reduced and let's see it affects our anything so refresh you can see it doesn't affected anything so that's how you can also reduce your code so in this video i have shown you how to create gulsa in canvas hope you like this video please like share and subscribe to my channel that is knowledge thrusters thank you so much for watching